हाउ इज माई नेबर अ वॉलमार्ट सिक्योरिटी गार्ड गाइज दिस क्वेश्चन इज आज बाई एन एच वन बी गाय इन अमेरिका हु हैज बिन हियर फॉर ऑलमोस्ट सिक्स ईयर्स हु हैज बिन इन अमेरिका फॉर ऑलमोस्ट सिक्स ईयर्स वाई इज माई नेबर अ वॉलमार्ट सिक्योरिटी गाय वॉल चेक अ नेबर्स सम ऑफ दैम विल बी बार टेंडर्स आई हैड अ बार टेंडर नेबर वैन आई वॉज अ नेच वन आई हैड अ क्लीनर नेबर लाइक हु वॉज अ हाउस क्लीनर I was a neighbor who used to deal in used cars, make to twenty five hundred dollars a month. Twenty twenty used car salesman dealer guy, not dealer, used car salesman basically, make fourteen dollars an hour, minimum wage. <laughs> so why it's possible? There are multiple things which are happening in your life. One, you are not. You think this money is a lot, so that's my first thing, right? It's not a lot. This hundred twenty k that you're making is zero money here in America. they along with the their salary plus their welfare schemes they mix approximately the same amount their money is before tax oh, sorry is 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 after tax your after tax money and their after tax money is seemingly simple but second thing your plan is to go, you have this thing about going to india or not going to win india so you don't solve your visa issue so you're on natural visa that's because and then you can buy a house you cannot do any experimentation with life you cannot do anything right so you can raise your income level some anyhow so basically that's the reason so th- another contributing factor is you basically are in hmm, you uh, you know you are um, you're, you you know you are not really working your income you are not working your visa issues yeah all these basically maybe a few other things which are related to this only uh, you will not be able, so so you are not able to get out of this visa you don't understand what's going on ha huh? you think you are a very educated person by indian standards you are and you know that you are shanjha by indian standards and you are but when you come here you live close to walmart security guy that's your problem right and you don't have any wonder what's going on i used to wonder that too what's going on around me what's going on <laughs> simple answer is the money that you make is very less and your visa is also keeping you low and and uh, you're not able to buy a house you're not able to do anything you're not able to do anything you may you may be married your wife may not be working you need to sing uh, at 120k or 150k you need two working hands you need two working people in the household to make 250k and then you'll be able to afford a house uh these days it salaries are even lesser than the amount of uh you know um inflation that has taken place house prices have gone up but the salaries have not become twice so all this is contributing to your poverty <laughs> you're poor you're very poor <laughs> you're class 3 of india america you're not middle minus you're low low middle yes you're low middle class lower middle class yeah that's what it is i hope this answers your questions and when you're living in an apartment guys in general for all my viewers who are in india who don't understand what i'm talking about if you are in america and you're living in a one bedroom apartment with two kids or two bedroom apartment with two kids you are basically living a lower middle class life and yes your neighbors will be the lower middle class people of america that's what will always happen if you want to realize your potential please watch my videos and understand how csf works the the complete success formula works my basic ses of principle says solve this visa issue first and then your income start income will start to rise and you will be able to realize your potential here in this country but the problem is you won't watch the video you won't solve any issue you just keep doing what you're doing you know happy life keep going never worry about never work about never work on your problems never understand the problems but this guy he does understand the problem this is the first symptom of the problem because this is the first symptom that i noticed back in 2000 after two or three years after two or three years in this country i started noticing this thing that everybody around me they're not very well to do what's going on so that's the first thing i noticed too right something is missing something is amiss something is there is some problem in this country in india i was an it engineer my college is a reputed college of in india and here and when i when i was i used to go on the road and other people used to treat me like a rock star so i was having multiple contributing factors to my like rock star treatment i was smart flamboyant from a top college of chandigarh right and i was uh, i was shaadi ke layak ladka right perfect candidate and now i america right i started a company also a company he has a company in america where i used to rock star treatment in india alas <sighs> in america my neighbors were all but security guys my neighbor my neighbors were what tenders my 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 roommates were my roommates were uh, retail shop uh, you know guys all these people yeah i used to wonder what's going on there is and people would not give me respect 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 i used not to get 
And that's what gnaws me from inside. What's going on? That why don't they respect? <laughs> it's very hard to get the respect from Americans, but that respect, but you can still get some good respect by giving good tips. Minimum $20 just as you enter a restaurant or $10. Tell minimum $10. $10 just as you enter a restaurant so that he knows you're not a cheap guy and you will give him 15% tip when the tap comes. This kind of just sets the tone. If you're with a family of four, it lets you wife and kids, then give $20. Just as you enter, give to the server $20 as a complimentary gift. And tell him it's complimentary. Please make sure you know you add you know tips to the tab separately. Just say that. Americans are like that. If you want some respect from them, this is the only this is the way. They need money. So you'll get some respect. But you should have money. All your money is allocated to things, right? So how would you spend this kind of this way? How would you spend this way? So to do this way, you have to make a lot of money. My CSO will teach you how to get rid of visa issues and how to get how to how to basically make money. It's full of secret shortcuts. It's full of secret shortcuts. Yes. And I will also not let you waste money and you, so that you don't fall prey to evil forces of human nature. <laughs> yeah, I will not let you fall prey to evil forces of human nature. Because in India, when you, you they send money to India and invest in real estate, you'll fall prey to evil forces of human nature. You'll end up losing everything. And I will not let you fall prey. We are a prey. I will not let you fall prey to evil forces of American system. Taxation, this, regulation, this, that, you know, just eat your life and you're left with nothing. I won't let you fall prey to that also. I'll help you make a lot of money. I'll help you make a lot of money and uh, save a lot of taxes, all legally, legally, legitimately. Do nothing wrong. That's never my motto. And, but I know a lot of legitimate methods. CPS will not tell you. I will not let you fall prey to, 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 to evil forces of American system. Yeah, in America, evil forces of American system eats you up. In India, evil forces of human nature eat you up. There is no law in India. So every, everything is, whatever is going on. In America, there's a lot of law. Everything is enforced very well. But then the system is so systematically, uh, system system is so well streamlined that they basically end up, you know, they have created system. The whole the system has been transformed into uh, an exploitation machine. You know, taxes, taxes, this, that, all kinds of property, you know, property taxes, all that stuff. And then you basically make money on taxes. You know, you know, they, they just keep taking everything out of from you. I won't let you take them away from you legally. Yes. So you need to watch my videos to understand why your neighbor is a Walmart security guy. Thank you, ladies.